Keisha Knight Pulliam and two of her partners launched a venture capital fund to support black women owned businesses. They were awarding $20,000 grants to businesses owned by black women. They had to be more than 50% owned by black women. Well, now the guy that was behind the U.S. Supreme Court affirmative action case um, is actually suing this venture capital firm, saying that they're discriminating against other people because their grants are limited to black women-owned businesses. As a lawyer, I'm curious to see how this plays out. Because in the legal field, even when you sue someone and let's say they have a frivolous claim, you actually have to spend money defending it and you can actually run out of funding. And so for this venture capital fund to have the mission of supporting black women and now have to concentrate their efforts on defending a case, that may impact their ability to function. Let me know in the comments, do you think this is fair or foul?